What if I told you that the WordPress Astra theme got even better with version 4.0? Hello, I'm Kay from Brainstorm Force, and today I'm excited to unveil the new Astra 4.0, totally redesigned to improve your user experience. And if you watch until the end, you will know exactly the hidden gems of this version for both the free and the pro version. And if you stick until the end, I will share with you a previously pro feature that now comes free. Yes, you heard right totally free. So make sure you watch the whole video. So let's start with the redesigned admin dashboard. So previously to access the Astra dashboard, you had to go to appearance and then Astra options, and then you would land here. Now that made it difficult for new users to find all the options. Whereas now with version four, you got this handy first level menu item. And when you click on it, you can now access the new redesigned admin dashboard. Next, now that we're in the new admin panel, let's take a look at the quick settings. Now, as you may know, the WordPress customizer is great, but comes with a lot of options. It's not always easy to find what you're looking for. So let's say here, I'm looking to change the logo, the identity, where do I go? Whereas in the new redesigned dashboard, it's way easier. We got the quick settings. And if I want to change the identity, all I have to do is click on site identity. It's going to open a new tab with the customizer, but straight to the point. Now, not only is this tool gonna save you time, every time you need to make little tweaks, but if you are an agency owner, that's gonna save you a ton of time because that's gonna limit the support requests because now your clients can quickly locate those settings without asking you. Next, still in the new admin dashboard, let's talk about the pro modules management because with this section, you can quickly activate and deactivate your preferred pro modules in a very straightforward way. Now this is on the free version, so of course you can't activate it, but if you have pro, all you have to do is just activate it like this, or you can activate it all or deactivate it all. And to make it even easier, you can quickly access the documentation or customize the settings by just clicking on handy links. Now for third-party integration like WooCommerce, Easy Digital Downloads, LearnDash and Lifter LMS, of course you will need to install these before you can activate or deactivate the options. Next, general settings. So the options that were previously spread in the old version are now neatly organized in the new version in the settings tab. So all you have to do is click on settings and you can now find all the settings in one place, like managing your license, file generation, performance, version control, and white labeling, which is a pro feature and allows you to just mask the name of Astra and make it your own so that if you're working with clients, they will see the name of your company instead of Astra. And if you're interested by the pro feature that Astra has to offer, you find a handy link in the description below. Okay, last but not least about a redesigned admin dashboard is a useful plugin section. From here, you can install and activate our other plugins like Spectra, which is our free WordPress page builder. You got a starter templates plugin if you want beautiful designs in just one click. You got Sharecard, which is a new way to sell on WordPress and CardFlows, which you probably know and which is the number one sales funnel WordPress Builder. Next, and I personally love this one, a totally redesigned mega menu admin interface. Because yes, the pro version of Astra allows you to create beautiful mega menus like this one. But previously, when you wanted to access the mega menu settings, it would open a modal window. So you didn't know what you were really working on. Whereas now it opens an off canvas menu, which gives you more context about what you're working on and also better optimizes the visual space. But that's not all because you can now change the styling and position of icons. All you have to do is open the off canvas settings, go to icon position. Let's put it after the menu label. And next, let me go into design and let me change the primary color. So I'm going to pick this color here, click save changes. And now if I go back and refresh, voila, it's after the label and I've changed the color. Next, still in our mega menu, the header color is now added for mega menu items. All you have to do is click on the Astra menu settings. And then in the off canvas panel, all you need to do is click on the design tab, then scroll to where it says colors, and then you can pick your favorite color. And once you're happy with it, Click on save changes. And now the heading in your mega menu should reflect your changes. Next, you can now add gradient backgrounds to your mega menus. So once again, click on the Astra menu settings button and in the off canvas panel, click on the design tab. And next, what you want to do is change the background type from classic to gradient. Pick the gradient that you want 
And once you're happy with it, click on save changes. And now if I open my mega menu, as you can see, the changes are reflected. Well, we could have picked a better gradient, but you get the idea. And last but not least for a mega menu, we now have divider options. So if you click on the Astra menu settings in the opening panel, once again, you want to go to design. And now if you scroll down, we have divider options. So you can change the divider settings from solid to dash, double, dotted, or none. You can change the top border width. Basically, you can style and change all the dividers in your mega menu. Now, as mentioned, the mega menu feature is a pro feature, but fear not because there are plenty of free gems in this version. Next, Astra 4.0 comes with a new narrow width layout. As you know, Astra comes with many layouts for posts and pages. We got the box layout, we got the content box layout, full width contained, full width stretched, but now it comes with a new narrow width layout. So if I click on it, as you can see, it's just going to restrict the content horizontally. And that gives it a more minimal and elegant look. And you can easily change the width by playing with this slider. So all you have to do is change the value and it's gonna get reflected here in the canvas. Now you can use these settings for posts and pages, but also for blog pages, archives, and custom post types. So if you want to change this setting globally, all you have to do is go to global, container, and then you get all the options that we saw previously. But now you can also change custom post type settings individually. So let's say that you build a website for your church and you build a custom post type to enter your sermons. So with the previous versions of Astra, you were constrained to use the same settings for the blog post and for the custom post type. But now with Astra 4.0, you have custom post types here. And when you click on it, I see my sermons custom post type. I can click on single sermons. And now I can change my layout. I could even use the narrow width layout that we just talked about. And that's not all, because now still in the customizer where it says the name of the CPD title with the option, you see a little arrow here. So all I'm gonna do is click on the arrow and now I have a new set of options where I can change the banner layout. So I get this one, layout one, and layout two. So let's try layout two. And as you can see, I have a total different banner design. Now, depending on which banner layout you choose, you will see different options. And don't forget to hit the design tab right here because you'll find many, many more options. This new set of upgrades for post pages and custom post types is what we call the dynamic customizer. Okay, next let's talk about the new Astra homepage. So once you've gone to appearance, themes, and once you've installed Astra, you have two options. The first option is to just click on activate. And once you do that, you'll be served with a homepage with your latest blog posts. But now with Astra 4.0, if you click on live preview, you're now served with the new homepage. All you have to do is click on activate and publish. And now we have a totally new and beautiful redesigned homepage that can serve as a basis for a new website. Now, if you've changed your mind, fear not. All you have to do is go to settings, reading, and then instead of a static page for the homepage, choose your latest posts. Then click on save changes. And now if we refresh our page, voila, we still have the beautiful styling, but we're back with our latest posts. And that takes us to our new feature, smooth scroll idea. So as I click on any of the menu items, as you can see, it takes me smoothly to the desired section. Now, in order to enable this in the customizer, you wanna to go to global. Then you wanna scroll down to where it says miscellaneous. And then you wanna enable smooth scroll to idea. And the process is very easy. You can do it with any link, but here we're gonna do it with our menu. So for that, we go to appearance menus. And then I'm gonna add a custom link. And all I'm going to do is add the pound sign and then one word in this case, services. Next, I wanna edit my page. So I'm opening the home page. I'm going to select my services container, and then I'm gonna scroll down in the right pane to where it says advanced. And as you can see here where it says HTML anchor, I've added services, exactly the same word that I use in the menu. Then once I'm happy, I click on update and voila. Now when I click on services, it's gonna take me smoothly to the R services section. Whereas with the previous versions of Astra, there was no smooth scrolling, so it would be something like this. I click on learn more and it's taking me straight to the section, but no smooth scrolling. 
Next, and that's a pro feature, but if you're using custom layouts with Astra, you're gonna like this one. So this looks like a normal page, but it's actually loading a custom layout from Astra. So it's very subtle, but here in the admin bar, you see this little icon, and now you can edit the custom layout right away. So previously you had to go in the back office and just find where it was, and now it's pretty easy. Edit custom layout, all I have to do is click on this link and it's taking me straight to where I can edit this custom layout. It might look like nothing, but that's gonna save you a ton of time. Now that works for custom layouts, but if I was using a custom header, which is another one of Astra's pro features, it would work the same. All I would have to do is go right here in the top admin bar and then I could access the link to edit it straight from here. Next, new colors and typography. So if designing is not your thing, then the colors and font that the theme uses will give you a clean and minimal design that is well suited to modern tastes. So at the beginning of this video, I promise you that one of our previous pro features is now free. And it's one of the features that many of you will be using on all of your websites. So we're happy to announce that the back to top feature is now free. So once you click on it, smooth scrolling all the way to the top. To enable the feature, just go to the WordPress customizer, then global, then you want to go to scroll to top and then you want to enable scroll to top. You can also choose to display on desktop mobile or desktop and mobile. You can choose the position and the icon size. And don't forget to click on the design tab where you can change the color, hover color, background color and border radius. We know you love free stuff, so we hope you're going to love this one. A lot of work has been going into this 4.0 version. The redesigned dashboard and mega menu along with the ability to quickly see and edit custom layouts will improve your efficiency in managing your website. The narrow layout, scroll to top, smooth scroll and the new typography will make your users have a better browsing experience. We can't wait for you to try all these new features and create even better websites. And if anything goes wrong, you can always use our handy rollback feature. Now, which feature are you most excited about and why? please let us know in the comments below. Now, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. It encourages us to create even better content to serve you. Also, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss anything. We hope that you will enjoy Astra 4.0 as much as we had fun building it.